All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Frieden Beyond Journey's End, episode four. In episode three, we had uh, Fern and Frieden. It once again been another year, year since the last episode, so the years are skipping um, as we go along. Um, first half of the episode was about uh, Frieden getting gifts, or well, like a gift, and then announcing for uh, Fern's birthday. Presumably she knew it was her birthday and she was just trying to kind of like be more in be, be more involved in the people that she travels with lives and obviously humans. That's kind of the main goal. Which is really sweet. Or it could have just been a coincidence that it was also her birthday, but she just wanted to do something nice for her. Probably she knew it was her birthday though. Um so that was nice. And then in the second half of the episode, they traveled to a village which uh him, Ellen Co. had saved back in the day. Um to fight a sealed demon of corruption qual quell qual i believe um turns out he was shit back in the day he is no longer shit because they did the smart thing learned from his magic upgraded their magical technology and he came back they had defensive spells ready for him and they just blitzed him easy peasy um it was really cool to see that it was like yeah let me do the smart thing i'll see i'll seal you for eight years and then We'll come back and sort you out. But yeah, very good episode. And I'm definitely looking forward to the final episode of the first four of this season. And then we go to weekly. Um, but yeah, anyway guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's get right into this episode right now. 28 years after the death of him, other hero at the Grand's channel located in the Central Lands. Another year has passed. This shouldn't be a problem at all. Easy peasy. For magic. Damn, this is going to be good payment. Oh, what? Is a fake grimoire? Damn. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, that sounds too good to be true if it's a legendary mage. So does the... I'm guessing the guy in the village doesn't know that it's a fake. Unless he does. But Another long stay? Surely this can be fixed up real quick with magic? Three months? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Asleep like that? You're not cold? You're gonna have ink printed on your face, dude. Doing all this work for free and you're paying like people in the village for food and shit? Mm, don't know, I don't know about that one, Chief. Like if it was maybe like a, a few days or a one week job, sure, but bro. Bro, my ears get cold as hell in the winter. Never mind her with her big ass elf ears. Jeez, that must be awful. She does she does seem to give off the sloppy vibe. <laughs> I can't believe this has taken three months at this point. Just once. I'd like to see what that was. <laughs> oh, I hate that of all people. Ah, toasty fire. A third of it left, so like, probably like a month and a half. Doesn't look like much has changed. <laughs> Can we get a, like, a, a delete all wood spell? <laughs> Dead pirate, wow. Any treasure? Nope, just some seaweed. <laughs> like, I'll, oh, I thought they were both of them just lifting up. They were both lifting up half of the ship. Damn, nice and clean. Only, only for it to probably get messy again next year. Yeah, you can just wake her up. 
Oh, she's gonna do an all-nighter? Yikes. Yeah. <laughs> it's that crazy. Oh, so he just got really drunk and went to see the sunrise. Okay. Maybe it's really special. I love how Himel always saw the best in her. Just, like, pour water on her. Slap her awake. Come on. Alright, let's see this sunrise. And yeah, I was gonna say, I suppose it is, it is pre. It's just a regular sunrise, though. I guess the beauty of it is, is seeing other people appreciating the beauty. Yeah. Yeah, seeing your friends smile. Aww. Himal knew you too well. Aww, that's really sweet. Episode 4, The Land Where Souls Rest. Oh, damn. He's praying. He's a priest. Hmm. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, makes sense. But if he can't, if he can't say whether it exists or not, literally that, then you may as well just believe in it if you want to. It's a nice thought. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> now Aizen's doubting himself. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, look at him. He's getting old. 28 years after the death of Hima the hero in the Brett region located in the Central Lands. Hey. 30 years. Damn, call once in a while. She just comes around doing chores for her friends. I mean, he looks pretty good. I don't know if dwarves get grey hair, but he's, he's, he looks pretty good. Vol Basin. <laughs> A long time. Damn! I don't think she's that old. <laughs> the notes of Flam, the legendary mage. Ooh. That's like the third time this, this Flam person has been mentioned. Okay. This place is big. Searching for a large tree? Why does it have to be a large tree? <laughs> Fern in the background, how long is this going to take? Yeah. Fern's changing her. <laughs> Damn! Aizen? Strong as hell. Oh, she's making sour grapes for him. That's cute. Bro, runs on water too? Jeez. This dwarf. Once a party, always a party. She find it? Boredom. What do you mean by that? Are the notes going to have something to do with talking to the dead? Oh, cool. Very nice. That would be very helpful. I mean, it's more likely than resurrection or immortality being a thing. 
Oh, such good friends. The big ash tree. Yeah, this will probably be the one. Your master's hand. Wait, is this Flam? Is she Friden's master? Damn, how'd she know? What? So is this how she knew to look for the big tree? That's fucking crazy. What? Oh, and there are the notes. Wow. They literally look like they're there waiting for her. Oh, they're gonna tell her. Damn. That's such a crazy reveal. So magical and interesting. Yeah, she literally knew what she was coming for. Wow. I need to know more about this flam woman. God damn. Oh, what? Oral, the land where the souls rest. Oral was mentioned in the first episode, wasn't it? I think. Damn. There's literally a place where you can just chill with souls. It's not even a spell or anything. Crazy. It's more convenient if it does. Ah, oh, hate has rubbed off on him. Get up to the Google Maps. A continent called Ende. Fitting. Oh, what the fuck? Some massive Castlevania vibes going on here. Damn, is that going to be the goal for the series then? <laughs> the blackmail, the guilt tripping. Oh, I love these guys. At least they know where they're going. She knows how to get to the Demon King's castle. They've already been there to kill him. Classic. How is this the place where heaven is? Who chose the real estate? Wake up. Oh, she's like a little kid. She's like thousands of years old. <laughs> but she does teach you stuff. I love how there's statues of Himel everywhere because he travel around to help lots of places. It's nice that she keeps her promises. Oh, I guess actually, of course, she'd know her birthday. She'd been with her for years, and Hater uh, probably told her as well. Honestly, no wonder she sleeps so much. Like, she's got so much more of life. She can just spend more time in bed. Yeah. Oof. That's kind of mean. <laughs> One one hundredth of your life. Oh, I made eyes and sad. <laughs> you corrupt priest. <laughs> I guessed it. Oh, what? I thought he was going to come with. Nah, you still got some kick in you, old man. Sounds easy enough. Ten years? Is that because you didn't know the way? Will we get there in less time? Well, I guess this place is like an end goal for them then. Maybe this... This might just be the journey of the series. Or the mission for the series, I should say. Mere 10 year adventure. God damn. Right, so that was Freedom Beyond Journey's End, episode 4. Fantastic four episode start to this series. I, I guess you could call it a prologue, kind of like what Oceanoko did um, with its very long first episode. I enjoyed it. 
Um, do I think that it could have just worked weekly? Kind of, yes. We, I don't think I had to start with these four episodes, but it was also nice to get that kind of all these stories and these episodes based around each party member out of the way. Um, so yeah, I think that was nice. I say out of the way, that's the wrong choice of words there. It was very wholesome. I really enjoyed this start of the series. Learning about learning more about the end and the party. Uh, watching Fern grow up kind of um, in her teenage years. And uh, now we have kind of a mission for for the series as well, which is cool to see. Only a 10-year mission shouldn't be. Should. No biggie. But yeah, very excited to see where the series is going to go. Looking forward to next week's episode. As always, guys, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Like the video if you liked the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have an interesting day and peace out.